All right, just got out my uh, SKS. Just put a UTG 4x32 scope on there. Sorry, guys, the camera's jumpy, but uh, I just shot six rounds the first time out of that gun at this target, and uh, well, I didn't really waste any ammo getting the uh, scope set up. I mean, it's pretty it's pretty easy to uh set up the SKS cuz once you once you're used to using the uh the factory the iron sights all all you really have to do is just uh aim the uh aim the gun at the target like you're going to shoot with your iron sights and then look into the scope to see where that's uh aiming at and all I do is just adjust the uh, scope up or down or left and right to uh, match where your your iron sights are sit, are sitting on the target. That's what I did, and uh, well, I well, I spent one shot. It was I think really low, so I uh, I think it was like way down here. Like that was before I used the iron sights to line up on the target. But um, actually. Uh, I, I just took the last four shots. I only put six rounds in. I, I messed up two of them, but yeah, the last four were right in the uh, right next to the bullseye. I mean, I could do some fine adjusting. Uh, I haven't I haven't touched the uh, side to side, or left or right, too much. Um, but yeah, it's really easy to uh, sight in a scope if you have a gun with iron sights and you're used to those iron sights because all you do is just uh sorry i'll uh show you guys a little bit later but um all i did is have your gun on a gun rest or a gun vice aim right there with your iron sights and um because i was pretty used to shooting the iron sights for a while i've shot a few hundred rounds with my sks with no scope so i knew pretty good at 50 yards where to, to set the iron sight so all I did is just set them right there on the orange dot and then just moved the scope adjusted it up and down left and right to where it was pointing at this at the same spot that the iron sights were showing and well I spent six rounds two of them before I uh, really adjusted the scope yeah the last four are within about a little bigger than a uh, a quarter. I'm not talking about a quarter of an inch. I'm talking about uh, an actual quarter. Uh, yeah, those are within about an inch, and I haven't even fi fine tuned it yet. And that was just with uh, a simple FMJ herder rounds. And uh, I'm sure I could definitely get much better results than that at uh, fine tuning the scope. Um, yeah, I wasn't even using expensive ammo. I was just using cheap uh, herders. I think it was 122 grain or 123. I forget. This is always some of them are different, but uh, yeah, I just uh, I walk back to the the gun. Yes, I just started shooting at 50 yards. I haven't shot the scope at all. This is the first uh, six rounds I've shot with it, so I'm definitely impressed with the gun performance because me with iron sights uh, the further you get to me for me it is a lot harder to uh, set up the gun because the iron sights it's, it's really hard to aim at the exact same spot uh, every time you shoot but yeah this is all I'd set up at my gun as just fired six rounds there's the target. We're at 50 yards. Give or take one or two feet. But yeah, it's uh, there's the scope. Everything clears just fine. I uh, I took this off to load it, but I, I think I actually measured it. You can leave this um, cap on without um, loading these without a problem. Like this. Yeah, it, it just fits in there. See. So just enough room there. So I guess the thing now is to uh, keep shooting it and uh, adjust the scope so it's, I mean, for me that was plenty good enough shooting 
as as it was right there. I spent six rounds, and that thing's already hitting the bullseye almost every time. And uh, I guess we'll just see how things hold up. I mean, how the uh, mounts hold up, uh, the uh, these quick detach levers. I mean, how this only thing left, yeah, is just figure out how this mount holds up and how the scope holds up after so many rounds, how all the bolts have to stay tight or not. So I'm very, very happy and impressed with this uh, UTG scope. I mean, it was very easy to sight in. I spent, I spent two rounds getting it sighted in, and I'm still not even finished. And it's already hitting quarter um, inch groups at 50 yards with me not even... Uh, um, perfectly trying to aim still every time so uh, definitely uh, very happy with that much better performance than using the iron sights but yeah here's the box I think it was like a, a $60 scope yep so all that yeah I'm very happy with it as long as it uh is reliable and last it holds at zero and all that stuff uh, I'll be happy I'm definitely gonna buy another one of these for uh, if I get any any other guns get the same setup but um well I brought with uh, 30 30 more rounds of herders and uh, I guess we'll see how they do yeah this is just uh, cheap little ammo nothing special but I'll let you guys go Let's see if this will look through. Nope. This phone is too tall to look through there. Yep. Got that. Alright. Cool. I'll keep guys updated.